it, it was games in the afternoon, which was really easy because we were doing running. What the students loser, Mr. Coots, the sports teacher, was shouting through his megaphone, and I felt pretty cute because using he doesn't even know who I am. Watch this, Mr. Coops, Darren said, and made his leg go as fast as he could, but I still beat him easily with one step. No banana, Darren Fisky shouted, Mr. Coops, which is one of his favourite catchphrases. I've never seen him with any actual bananas, so it's lucky no one ever runs fast enough to win one. On the way home with Bonky, I was thinking how my day hadn't been the first one of my life ever. I stopped, stopped to cross the road for about a millisecond and looked down and saw that someone had struck a poster to black poles. Dan was running off cackling and seeing as a as I know Darren's dad is a post putter upper upper because he came into school one Friday afternoon to talk all about it. I suppose it was him that must have put it there. Maybe you should just go back to being rubbish on Barry Russell again, said Bunky. Thanks, Bunky, that makes me feel so much better, I said in the voice, voice which rat boy uses when he hates not bread and I stormed off home with my still making it really hard to storm. How was your day? My mum said when I got home. Rubbish, I said, handing her my handing her my stick and she gave me a massive hug which I spurned out of but secretly quite like I'm gonna do my homework, I said, and went upstairs. Once I was in my room, I threw my bag on the on the floor and went over to vending machine mum costume. There was a future rat boy episode. Once there were his this massive robot came to town and everyone thought he was a new ruler. What I had to do was add a few roboty things to my outfit and I'd have everybody worships me too. At seven o'clock when me and Bunky usually phone Miss, Mrs. Trumpet face to ask if Poopy is there, the phone rang. Barry is Bunky! My mum shouted up the stairs. Tell him he's a poo bum. I shouted down the stairs and carried on making me my costume until it was time for bed. When I shut my eyes and tried to dream about being a giant robot.